Zach. Um, I'm a musician. I got into music when I was about 17. Um, like my, my family have all been a little bit musical, but not like something serious. It was kind of just a bit of banter that they did on the side. They never really forced me into it. And uh, one summer holidays, I was just really, really bored. It sounds silly, but really bored and had a guitar in my room. Started picking up this song, um, Mumford and the Sun song, Roll Away Your Stone. Um, it's quite a nice tune. And uh, so I tried to play it, play it, play it. Come the end of my summer holidays, I was like addicted. Like it was like, it was like, you know, like my med melodic heroine almost. Um, and that was me hooked. And then I spent like the whole of my last year at school skipping classes to play guitar. I think, you know, growing up, I did see my dad occasionally pick up the guitar and he'd play a couple of tunes. And my mum the same, they'd occasionally just play a tune here and there, maybe on a Christmas day, you see him bring it out. And that. But I think what really inspired me was just the feeling of me doing it. You know, the fact that I learnt this song and I learnt these, learnt these three chords, it just, it was just like, wow, I can do something. I can do something creative and loud and noisy and something that will, that is bringing me completely away from the person I was becoming. Um, well, my life is starting off, basically, step one. Um, started off kind of a bit crappy to be honest uh, my dad unfortunately uh, he committed suicide when I was quite a young boy and uh, something you I walked in on and saw unfortunately and uh, growing up since we've struggled I've struggled with mental health my sister struggled with mental health um, as I become a young man I start to make stupid decisions and get into situations that looking back on it I regret and it's the fact that what I sing about now is about the fact that I've met, I've experienced so much shit, so much crap, but I don't let that break me down anymore. It's like, do you let that be the rest of your life? You're this person who drinks, takes drugs, um, uses any excuse to do so, right, because of their past, or do you find something beautiful to cope with it and deal with it and turn it into something that was so negative into something that is creative and pure and that is completely separate from that past life stuff. I, so I messaged a guy that I knew. He says, there's an open mic night on tonight. I come to it, you'd love it. So we were like, fuck, do you want to put some songs together? Like, I, I can play so many songs, but in that moment, I forgot all of them. I go, well, find some songs, find some songs. We turned up and we were terrible. We were point blank terrible, never played before, but the moment I did it once, it was like, that scared the living shit out of me. So I started doing it more. And I'm feeling good. And the moment we break down that barrier and love what we're loving, everything, people will start getting on better. I think these days, you know, a lot of crappy music out there. It's a lot about fame and money and, you know, what, what you can gain out of it, unless the reason why it's done in the first place. So just don't forget.